Welcome to a milk full of wine and my meal plan and grocery haul for the week. This week, of course, went to Walmart again. Spent about $110 um, for a week. I have not put my meals into my planner yet. I usually do my planner on Saturdays. Saturday we were running around all day. Saturday night we went out with friends. Didn't get home till like 1 in the morning, 1.30. Um, Sunday, we were running around all day. Sunday night, friends came over. They didn't leave till like midnight. So, today I got up and worked out, and then I went grocery shopping, and now it's 3.30, and I still haven't done it. So, I'm just going to show you, or tell you, tonight is Monday. We're having leftovers. Um, tomorrow night, I think we're having egg roll in a bowl. Uh, Tuesday night, we're having... Baked flounder au gratin. Wednesday night we're having club sandwiches. Thursday night we are having, um, what are we having Thursday? So Monday was leftovers. Tuesday egg roll. Wednesday club sandwich, or Wednesday baked flounder. No, I can't remember. I don't remember. <coughs> so Monday leftovers. Tuesday, egg roll in a bowl. Wednesday, club sandwiches. Thursday, baked flounder. Friday, I haven't planned anything yet, but we have stuff in the freezer. We have, a po we have pork roast. We have, um, we have a pork roast. We have some hamburger. We have some chicken breast. And we have some chicken nuggets. We could do that. Saturdays we go out, and Sunday is Mother's Day, so I don't know what we're doing for Mother's Day. It's my choice, and I'm not cooking. My mom will be out of town, so I don't think we have to do anything with her. So that is our menu for the week. Um, and here's what I bought. I got some butter and some half and half for my coffee. I have some half and half. I haven't had coffee in I don't know how many days now. So I don't know what my half and half is looking like. I can't remember when I bought it or when I opened it. Some sharp cheddar cheese for the club sandwiches. Some some kimchi for the hubby's lunch. Some zucchini and some yellow squash. That's for the night we have the baked flounder. I'm just going to make, you know, put that in the uh, frying pan with a little bit of um, ham. And I put a little garlic in there and some onion and... Just make that as a side dish. Some bananas, a couple avocados, a couple tomatoes, a bag of lettuce, a bag of shredded lettuce, some Lunchables for the kids. Piper just picked out four pizzas. Um, two bags of the tri-colored coleslaw. This is for the cauliflower, for the um, egg roll in a bowl. Some broccoli slaw. I'm going to mix this with some vinegar and some other stuff and kind of make a kimchi out of it. Some Brussels sprouts and some cheesy broccoli rice. This is for the night we have the flounder. Some sweet and sour sauce. Two cans of chicken. Mackenzie asked me to pick these up for her, for her to eat after she gets off of work at night. I grabbed a couple of little tuna packets for me to have for lunch. Um, they were on sale, so I just grabbed them. Uh, these were a dollar. Albacore tuna packs and a lemon pepper. I don't like lemon or pepper, but I don't know, for some reason I was like, I think I'll have this. <clears throat> a dozen eggs. A gallon of milk. Some black cranberry juice. A pizza the night that we have the egg roll in a bowl. The kids will have pizza because they don't like egg roll in a bowl. Some Kraft macaroni and cheese for the night we have club sandwiches. The Cars movie is coming out. My kids are super, super excited. Cars 3, so we're going to have Cars shaped macaroni and cheese. Panko bread crumbs for the night we have the flounder. Piper grabbed these chicken ramen, even though we have a lot of ramen already. She also grabbed these Pocky Hellman's mayonnaise. We have um, a mayonnaise already, but they had 
just a couple more of the bonus size, so I wanted to grab it just to stock up. Some Hershey's candy bars. They have been having s'mores at night after dinner. Um, Mackenzie's been making them just on the stove top, and we've run out of candy bars. Some cosmic brownies for Logan. Some applesauce. I eat this in the morning before I work out so I can take my pill really quick before I work out. Some shin ramen for the hubby. Some Cheez Its. And for bread this week and chips, we got some pretzel rods for the hubby. Some white cheddar popcorn. This is for me. Some butter popcorn for Piper. Some Funyuns. Some cheese puffs or cheese Cheetos. Some regular white, white bread. Some of the Healthy Life white bread, that's for me. And some Cocoa Pebbles, or whatever they are, the generic Cocoa Pebbles for Logan. And some freezer bags. This is the only non-grocery um, item that I had to buy. And we bought some dog food. And again, I spent about $110. This is about a week's worth of groceries. I already had the pork for the... Um, I already had the pork for the egg roll in a bowl, and I already have the lunch meat for the club sandwiches. We bought that at Costco this week, which I will put on the end of this haul, and I bought the flounder at Costco this week. So that is our haul, and if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and if you have not subscribed, please do. We're very close to 500, and we will see you next Wednesday with our next haul. Have a fantastic week, and if you are a mom, happy Mother's Day this week and Hello, welcome to a mug full of wine. I have a quick Costco haul today We've got some fully cooked bacon and this lunch meat pack Someone I think it was Shelly's home life has been talking about club sandwiches So tomorrow night we are having club sandwiches for dinner. So I got this three pack. It has turkey ham and uh, smoked turkey and then the fully cooked bacon which is just super easy I like to keep it in the freezer and then just grab a few pieces out I also got Maxwell House coffee they had them for six dollars so we bought two of them um, Mackenzie loves these sandwich thins we're going to put two of them in the freezer and then she'll just eat one and then when she's done grab the other ones out of the freezer this naan, the other day I bought naan at Walmart, and for six pieces I spent $7.50. This is 18 pieces, and it was 5 bucks. So this is a much better deal, and it was delicious. They were sampling it, and it was super good. I also picked up some flounder. I've never made flounder before, but I told the hubby, pick out a fish, and I will find a recipe on Pinterest. So... My quest for the day, I'm going to go sit out on my deck because it's a beautiful day. And I'm going to go sit out there with my iPad and find a flounder recipe on Pinterest. And then we're going to have flounder this week. And we also got some guacamole. And we got this um, bread steak. We're going to have this for dinner tonight. It's Sunday. And I we had um, Cinco de Mayo tacos on Friday and we have a whole bunch of tortillas left over and um, we also have a whole bunch of like taco meat and chicken taco chicken left over so I'm going to make um, nachos and I also have all the tortillas left over so I figured we would get a skirt steak and put that on the grill cut it up and make some fajitas out of it and use the leftover tortillas and then use all the leftover meat and stuff and make nachos, and that's what we're having for dinner tonight. And then tomorrow night, which is Monday, we were, go we're gonna have some club sandwiches with the other stuff, and then one night this week we're gonna have flounder. So we have part of the week already taken care of, and that is our very small Costco haul. I think it was 90 bucks. And that um, is it for now, and I will have a grocery haul for you on Wednesday. See you then, bye.